Blake, you got to get better. Cause Central is getting the butt kicked. Yeah, I got this little letter. I'm trying to break it down. But let me tell you, Corey, background. He started off crazy. Parties full of shouties. Religious ceremonies where people was getting naughty. But all that changed. The truth of God reigned. The gospel spread within him like viruses in his veins. But man, even though his heart's rearranged, he found himself caught up in some of his old ways. He laid up with women and sin and was getting strange. Thought the more he sinned, the more Jesus was pleased to say. He thought cause he accepted his brother touching his mother. That he was spiritual cause Here we are with Big Shane at Mount Pleasant. He's getting ready for the big game tomorrow night. Now, Big Shane, Mr. Mike took the belt from you last week in the pillow joust. We expect you to get it back this week. What do you think about that? Big Mike's going down. But you heard it from right here from Big Shane. Big Mike's going down this week. It's bring a friend night. Hey, Big Shane, check him out. A lot of sin. I can't forget the problems of people living with fear. I got this little letter. I'm trying to break it down. Blake, I saw your 40 yard sprint on the sideline, man. Not even wearing a helmet. What were you thinking? Your team is getting beat right now because, you know, MP Tigers. Go. That Corey got married, but everywhere it turns. He sees lust burn and women waiting to serve him. Yeah, and Corey's learning. Satan wishes to turn him. Oh. Wow, Blake, your 40 yard run without your helmet was awesome. I want to be just like you when I grow up. But God put together, let nobody put a spit in it. See, that ain't Here we are, Central versus Mount Pleasant with our Athlete of the Week, Blake Blackwater. Blake is the Athlete of the Week. Unfortunately, he was injured right before the game. But congratulations, Blake. You are our Athlete of the Week. We'll see you next week. Game of the Week, Mount Pleasant versus J.M. Robinson. See, I need to take a second to explain that Corey ain't a person, but a...